These rattlers eat, play, and pray together. Creating a brotherhood to beat the North Carolina Central Eagles, but FAMU will be missing their main player this homecoming game. Due to head coach Joe Taylor's retirement, mental preparation is key for the team. Coach Earl Holmes serves as acting head coach. You know, at the end of the day, we all understand that the uh, show must go on. It's, uh, it's about FAMU, it's about the process, and uh, it's about the blueprint. And guys continue to uh, move forward, and practice has been going very well for us. The players also have their methods of handling this situation. Positivity and focus is evident. Basically, uh, clear my mind, you know. Um, when you play this game of football, you can't have anything on your mind from the outside world. You can't bring anything in because it'll slow you down. One player even notes the spark that Coach Holmes, former linebacker of the Pittsburgh Steelers, adds to the program. He's adding a new spark of energy. He's handling things in practice different, and it's just been a lot of fun. And We'll just see where, how everything goes. Coach Taylor touches base on his sudden departure and leaves his team with some final words. I wanted to do it just before the season ended to give my, uh, I wanted to just thank all the great people that have been so much to this, uh, you know, 40 years. I just love them all. I love this community. I just thank you all so much for the opportunity. Uh, to end my career in the, one of the most prestigious and outstanding institutions in America. The Rattlers last game of the season will be on Saturday, November 17th in Orlando at the Florida Classic, where they take on Bethune-Cookman. For News 20 at 5, homecoming television special, I'm Ayanna Young. Go Rattlers! Win! Win! One, two, three, win!